Hello, my name is Tristan Wisry and I'm from Queenstown Secondary School. Today I shall be talking about the VIA project I did in Red Cross. The VIA project was a Red Cross awareness campaign to raise funds. The goal of it was to increase preparedness in our community and by raising funds for food aid and transport aid. This was to help resolve problems in a crisis and create stronger bonds within our community. The role I played in the VIA project was a group leader for my juniors. I had to make sure that you know what to do during the VIA project and also keep them safe in public. The challenge I faced in this VIA project would be that many people did not know that it was Flag Day or we were selling bears and they also did not want to donate. This would result in less funds being collected and making Flag Day or selling of bears not as helpful. This would mean that we would have to do these events more times in a year to raise the funds to meet our goal. However, the solution I thought of would be social media. As you know, social media is a way, is a very big thing now in Singapore as it is a smart country. Everybody nowadays owns a phone or social media account, which means that if we were to share something on social media, it would, it would spread awareness about Red Cross and thus leading to more people knowing what we're doing on the day or what we're going to sell. The pros of this of social media would be that it costs little to nothing. As social media account, you only need to make an account and only take a photo, which would mean you'd spend little to nothing. It is also easily accessible and long-lasting. Since everyone nowadays owns a computer, they can easily make an account for social media. And since technology is always advancing, social media will be here for many years onwards. Lastly, we can easily share information online, which means many people can find out about what we do and what we're selling. However, there are a few cons for social media. For example, those who are not tech savvy may not be updated on what we're doing and thus be unable to share with other people who might want to donate or even buy a bed. Information may also be lost along the way as some people may accidentally send the wrong dates to their friends or family, thus leading to misconception and confusion. However, I still feel as though social media would be a great way of increasing awareness and solving these challenges as it will not only give knowledge to people online, it will also, might also prompt people to volunteer themselves to help collect funds. So, yes, thank you.